you're on the low block over here on the right side. Okay, uh, why do you have your hand up in the air? Um, well, for this play, we have two of our best three-point shooters out here, and uh, Tia Gibbs, who is top three three-point shooter on our team, um, I'm trying to get her a screen for her to get an open shot uh, out in the corner. And if our post player can't get it to her, um, you know, first look is to look in the post. So I was initially setting her a screen and then posting at the beginning. Are you trying to make contact every time you're in the block? Oh, most definitely because, you know, you never know when your post defender is going to take a break and you can get an easy layup. So um, all the time you should be ready to look to score in the post. Okay, this again is against zone. So you're running your zone offense and what are your responsibilities inside the zone offense? Um, well, first look is definitely uh, get to the block and, and post up, but if not, we want to keep it spread, keep it wide, make those guard defenders have to come out and guard our three-point shooters so we can have that middle space open. Um, and here, we're just cutting and moving. You never, you know, Coach always tells us never to stand and never be close to the ball. You always, always want to be cutting and moving, making the defense having to react to where you, what you're doing. Now, one thing that you demand when you catch the ball on the block is a double team. Have you worked on your counters? Um, I have a little bit this summer, you know, um, just because with uh, Shoney being gone, you know, our post play is going to be a lot stronger, I think, and uh, I think our guards are going to look to get it inside the post a lot more, so I, I have been working on that. Well, we're looking forward to seeing all of your skill set on display this year, Sarah. Thanks for being with us. Thanks for having me.